But my main reason for standing today, Leader, is really about the flooding and the human misery that has befallen people. Like half of Ireland is underwater and has been underwater for the last month. And the bottom line for me is anyone that has been flooded in 215, that was flooded in 209, has been failed by the state and the government. Because where works were done, and we have a great example of successful works in Money More, Orden More, where we got all the agencies into a room, where we got the National Parks and Wildlife agreeing that the OPW could lead, where one farmer worked with me with 52 farmers, and these families are relieved. They weren't reflooded this time. Now, we do have to look at a lot of solutions, and some have been mentioned by Senator Mullins and Senator Quinn today, but the Woodland League has has approached me with one very interesting solution that has worked in Wales in particular. The, a Bangor University study led by farmers has shown that where uplands are planted by native trees with deep roots, they can absorb water or rainfall 67 times faster than grassland. They have experienced in Wales 29% decrease in flooding in their lowlands with just 5% planting of native trees in uplands. Now, isn't that good news and something we should look at replicating? Norway has almost no flooding because they have allowed for the natural regeneration of their forests for 50 years. We have not done that. So my recommendation, Minister, and I'm glad, our leader, I'm glad that you're saying we'll have the Minister in the House next week, is that Minister Coveney needs to look very seriously at, at this recommendation and to, we need to discuss the planting of perhaps 10% of our uplands, which at a conservative measure could yield 40% less flooding. Now, we had Bob Geldof last week in Tour Valley Lee, who now has committed to helping us again fund our... Um, fundraise to alleviate the, the, the awful flooding we have at Tour Valley Lee. That's not a sustainable solution. That's helping us. But what I'm talking about here, about the planting of our uplands with native trees, where we have the evidence to support it and where we'll incentivise our farmers through grant diversion to be flood protectors, wouldn't that be a wonderful outcome? Because Power. climate change is on its way. And it's here to stay.